This machine here is the Exact MCT machine, and um, uh, we've measured the part inside this chamber here, and it's a CT machine that works on the same principle as a CT machine in a hospital, except that uh, in a hospital the patient stays still and the machine goes around them. In this case, we put the part inside the machine, close the door, and it's the part that stays around, the machine stays still. It creates a representation that we can then compare to the CAD model, the nominal. Here what we have is a colour map that shows that uh, green, if the part's green, that means that it's good, and if it's starting to go blue uh, or yellow, that's where it's going away from, from nominal. Well, probably the most striking thing is that it can see right the way through. So, with every other type of machine apart from this one, you can only measure what you see. If you can't see it, you can't measure it. That's not the case for this. So, for example, if I just take away the outside, you can look at this, these cross sections through the middle. Right down inside the part, on the back of surfaces, that you would never be able to measure with any other type of machine. The power of this is such that if we go forward a couple of decades, maybe all parts will be measured this way. Some materials are easier to get through than others. Plastic, pretty much any thickness of plastic is no problem. My job is to choose amongst the many uh, solutions that we have, which is the one that is most appropriate. And if it's something that requires measuring internal features that you can't see, possibly inside an assembly that you don't want to open up, this is the only game in town.